India and China should put the boundary issue in proper place and work together to bring the situation at their borders under normalized management as soon as possible. Chinese Foreign Minister Qin Gang told his Indian counterpart S J Shankar, reported news agency PTI, citing the Foreign Ministry. Qin's first in-person meeting with Jay Shankar on Thursday came on the sidelines of the G20 Foreign Minister's conclave in Delhi amid the nearly three-year-long border row in eastern Ladakh. India has been maintaining that its ties with China cannot be normal unless there is peace at the border. Jay Shankar conveyed to Qin that the state of India-China relations is abnormal as their talks focused on addressing the challenges in bilateral ties. especially that of peace and tranquility in the border areas PTI reported discusses border dispute we also had a brief discussion on what was happening in the G20 framework but the thrust of the meeting was really on our bilateral relationship and the challenges in the bilateral relationship especially that of peace and tranquility in the border areas Jay Shankar said Both sides should implement the important consensus of the leaders of the two countries, maintain dialogue and properly resolve disputes, and promote the improvement of bilateral ties and the steady moving forward of the relations, Keen told Jay Shankar. State-run Xinhua news agency quoted an official press release from the Chinese Foreign Ministry as saying, "The boundary issue should be put in the proper place in bilateral relations," Keen said. adding that the situation on the borders should be brought under normalized management as soon as possible china is willing to speed up the resumption of exchanges and cooperation with india in various fields resume direct flights at the earliest date and facilitate people to people exchanges keen said he said that the two sides should view their bilateral relations in the context of the once in a century changes in the world understand bilateral cooperation from the perspective of their respective national rejuvenation and be partners on the path to modernization china supports the indian side in fulfilling its chairmanship of the g20 and is ready to strengthen communication and cooperation to safeguard the common interests of developing countries and international equity and justice so as to inject stability and positive energy into the world keen said India assumed the presidency of the G20 on December 1st last year. Relations between China and India have been tense ever since the Eastern Ladakh military standoff between the two countries in May 2020. With input from PTI to Russia